Gravity will hold your spaceship on the ground. We need to build rockets with powerful engines that are stronger than the gravity. But before we do that, we will begin with a simple rocket powered with air. We will need printing paper or old newspaper, adhesive tape or duct tape, scissors, a thin 50 centimeter plastic tube, three quarters or half an inch in diameter, elastic PVC tubing or a rubber inner tube from a bicycle wheel, and a large empty soda or water bottle. And last but not least, some cardboard we got from a box. First, we need to make a body of our rocket. Roll the paper tightly around the plastic tube and glue it with your glue or adhesive tape so it keeps the shape. If you don't have paper, use old newspaper instead. Squeeze one end of your rocket and secure it with a closed adhesive tape. This will become the top of your rocket. Strengthen the opposite end of your rocket with a ring of adhesive tape. Make a nose cone of your rocket. You can roll a cone from paper and glue it to the front of your rocket. Now you need to make the three or four fins to stabilize your rocket, otherwise it will not fly straight. Tape the fins around the bottom end of your rocket and voila, you have a paper rocket. Here is a different rocket made from a bottle. Time to make the starting device. We need to connect the plastic tube and the bottle with elastic tubing. Make sure that both joints are tightly secured with the tape. Otherwise, the air will escape from our starting machine and the rocket will not fly very high. Now it's time to launch our rocket. Remember, always stay safe when performing experiments. Never direct the rocket towards someone or yourself. If you want to be an astronaut, you must be a very careful and responsible person. Let's put our rocket on the starting machine and begin our countdown. Three, two, one, go! Wow, great start! To launch the rocket again, simply blow some air inside the bottle like this. You can also build different kinds of rockets with your friends or family and compare how high or how far they can fly. 